Hello everybody, this is Daniel Galus. So in this short video I'll show you how to install to upgrade the Rico Magic MK802 version 3S stick. So first of all go to Ricomagic Chrome, the official site, then go to downloads section, then to MK802 version 3S Bluetooth here you have to download the latest firmware version this one from 21 January this year ok so press this link and download the firmware after you download the firmware you have to decompress the archive and you have these three files here you will find the instruction, here is the update image and here is the change log of this firmware ok so after you download the firmware you have to install the drivers ok so make sure you install the drivers for this device ok so next you have to use the air key batch tool ok and after that you have to put the Ricomagic MK802 version 3S in update firmware mode so take this thin stick put it in this reset hole and then plug the USB cable again in the OID on the go after that we take the stick out and the green button stand for one left. this button will be green so next we have to choose the image the part to our image oh, ok this one ok and press the restore button the third one and for my device so it will take about three or four minutes to install the firmware so download the firmware so you can read the instruction from the attach word document to do it step by step so here you'll find all the instruction you need to upgrade your Ecomagic MK802 stick here we go we are in this this step here ok, 3 minutes and I say let's take a look about the process almost there It's already. It's almost ready. Almost done. Okay. So. This is the final message. Restore done success. Okay. 
next you have to close here, press exit take out the USB cable and then you connect the device to the TV ok, let's do it hello everybody, this is Daniel Luz so in this short video I'll show you how to install to upgrade the Ricoh Magic MK802 version 3S stick so first of all go to ricomagic.com the official site then go to downloads section then to MK802 version 3S Bluetooth and here you have to download the latest firmware version this one from 21 January this year. Okay, so press this link and download the firmware. After you download the firmware, you have to decompress the archive and you have these three files. Here you will find the instruction. Here is the update image, and here is the change log of this firmware ok so after you download the firmware you have to install the drivers ok so make sure you install the drivers for this device ok so next you have to use the RK batch tool ok and after that you have to put the Ricomagic MK802 version 3S in update firmware mode so take this thin stick put it in this reset hole and then plug the USB cable again in the on the go so here we go so here we go this is the new firmware installed so this is the launcher browser play store explorer settings so let's go to settings to take a look to the numbers so the model number recommended can create 02 version 3s with Bluetooth Android version Jelly Bean 4.1.1 kernel version in here you can see is for this film is from 18 January in this year and this is the build number okay. so this is the build number 18 January this year okay let's see if there are any updates no the system is up to date ok so let's take a look at this explorer I just love it because it has samba and I can play with no problem at all my movies from Windows 8 so this is my my computer from there in here the share ok and I can play anything I want from my computer mm. it's very fast I just love it
So, nice. Okay, this is about File Manager the Explorer. Okay, let's take a look at Play Store. Let's verify in the root access. Okay, install root checker, accept. Okay, open. Agree. Okay, verify root access and the device had root access. So, let's take a look about uh, at the application. So, Google settings, the gaps are here, Gmail, Play Store, you have to install YouTube and the rest. But I love this firmware version, it's very nice, fast and pretty stable. That's it. Enjoy your new Vico Magic firmware. Goodbye.